Hi all folks, so somebody asked me how to install a ROM on HTC Evo Hacks.com. I know I've done it a bunch of times, but I wanted to show you again. So what we're gonna do is uh let's say you're gonna install the Evo Deck ROM. Um I think you don't need Google Apps. Oh actually you do need. Uh there'll be three files. I have links on this video. Go download those. Evo Deck is actually the one I recommend. And also, uh, if you want to overclock it, you can get the set CPU app. I'll have links on where you can download it too, or you can buy it on the market. Um, so you need three files. The first one is the Evo Deck, blah blah zip file, uh, and the second one is the Google Apps, and blah blah dot zip. And then the third one is Google Talk video. If you use Google Talk and you want video, go download those. Connect your phone to your computer and then copy over those three zip files don't unzip them just copy it over to your root folder and once you've done that we can go uh, once you've done that just turn off your phone power off okay and then what we're gonna do is uh, also if if this is another ROM, like anything that's uh, a ROM that's based on CM7, you'll need Google Apps and Google Talk because uh, basically Cyanogen, the guy who created, he got a DMCA cease and desist letter that uh, you know you can't add. Oh, oh, you can't add Google Apps to your ROM, you know. But you can add it like you know separately. So that's what happened. Anyway, what we're gonna do is. Hold the volume down and then hit the power button while holding down the volume down. That should get us into bootloader like that, right? That was easy to do, right? And it's going to cycle through. Uh, it's going to look for this file called pc36.img, which you can use when you're rooting and stuff. But um, Next, what we're going to do, hit go to recover using your volume buttons, hit the power button. <laughs> And uh, I'll have another video on just regular ROM, just to not confuse people. That way I can just point to it, like, how do I do this? Watch my other video. Whatever. Anyway, what we're going to do is uh, just wipe everything. You can also go to Backup and Restore. I have uh, videos on that too, how to backup um, your ROM on my site, hccevohacks.com. Just go there and you'll find it. And uh, just go to Wipe, hit Power Button, Wipe All Data Factory, Reset hit the power button this basically just you know this wipes out all the system data and stuff so we can write over it and won't have problems and also go down to Dalvi cache and hit the power button and hit the power button again and Dalvi cache sometimes causes hanging at boot screen that's why we clear it um, that's pretty much it and just hit return oh you can also wipe the battery stats if you want to hit the power button what that will do is it'll you know because the 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 Evo's battery or any Android phone's battery, it's uh you know it's not gonna be accurate unless the software on it is accurate. So that's why we when we reset the uh, battery status uh, via the software, it's gonna track accurately um, instead of like it might have the old old you know settings and it you know it might tell you that you have 10% battery when you actually have like 50% or more. Anyway, <clears throat> let's go to flash zip from SD card and hit the power button. And then let's toggle signature verification. Most of the time, um, you, you, you just toggle it because this will help you get over the uh, burning zip, uh, flashing zips. Sorry, I'm not to. Okay, toggle signature zip and then go to choose zip from SD card. And then we're going to go choose um, your ROM file first. So, uh, either, you know, Cyanogen 7, Mod 7 ROM, or in this case, I'm installing Evo Deck. So, I gotta go find Evo Deck. There we go. Gingerbread dash Evo Deck. That's the ROM file, right? And then hit the power button. Hit the power button again. And it's gonna install the ROM. And we'll be back after this. Hey, well, folks. So, the next we're gonna do is. Uh, if this is not a ROM based on uh, CM7, Sinogen Mod 7, or the Evo Deck we're installing right now, 
Um, what you want to do is just reboot the phone and you're done. But uh, for CM7 and the uh, anything based off CM7, usually you need to uh, zip the Google apps. So we're just gonna zip it instead of you know rebooting and then rebooting and coming back. So choose zip from SD card and choose G apps <coughs> dash um, Evo dash that one right there. That's our Google apps files. Hit the power button and hit the power button again. And that will install Google Apps. And uh, it says it's complete. And then we're going to go, uh, if you want Google Talk Video version 1.3, choose zip from SD card and choose, uh, where is it? Google Talk 1.3 blah blah dot zip. Okay? And hit the power button. And that'll install you know everything you need. And then you can uh, hit return, reboot system now. Well, folks, so it rebooted, and I have Evo Deck ROM here. I've got Gmail, Market, um, also Google Talk with video. Um, this is the most complete ROM. Anyway, that's how you install Evo Deck ROM or any CM7 ROM um, and uh, or other ROMs. Uh, you just have to skip the last two zip files for regular. Uh, ROMs. Um, anyway, this was for um, this is for user monkey four six five five eight. He asked me, "This looks like a beast ROM. Can you show me how to install it?" So there you go. See you later. Happy Father's Day. Oh yeah.